White it's B. all for, for yeah. EJ. Los Angeles Chargers. Well, that's the whole reason I'm they so, moved up to LA. They're I'm like, so hey, problem. To it, man. The problem's up there. We'll move up there. We'll snag us the, one of the best Madden players in the world. Hey. And, and it's really, it comes down to Leonard Fournette. If he can break some tackles, maybe a long one in this one, that could be the difference. Yeah, and his scramble ability with Marcus Mariota is going to be world it class. It won the game against Skimbo. It won him the game against the number one player in the world right now, Michael Skimbo. And you saw Rico break down. Uh, when you give problem Anthony Barr and Heath user controlling him, that six foot five fast phenom is going to make some plays. Deliverance is going to have to watch out for him. Well, it's the steel curtain of Pittsburgh against the Los Angeles Superchargers here in the AFC. And I will say we had a small break in between the game, this game right now after Pablo beat Skimbo. And Deliverance won his match against Spot Me. Deliverance, I think he was with his girlfriend, Lori. I, I don't know what he was doing, but Problem went straight to the back with Serious yeah. Mo. I saw them. They got right Locked on. In. They got right on the sticks, and they took that downtime not to hang out, but to prepare and practice for deliverance. And that's a different kind of beast than deliverance is used to dealing with. I mean, you and I had a goat for a reason. Something called the brisket basket. That's yeah. what we did. We, we didn't we, lock in. People think we just talk about brisket. <laughs> no. Like, we about that brisket life. <laughs> Went straight to the food court, put the brisket sandwich down, mac and cheese on the side, and now we're here rocking in the AFC Championship. It was a 4 of 10, but we will take it at this point. The deliverance going right up the sideline. AFC Championship, Steelers, Chargers. Fifteen seconds into this one. Right at the 50, and there goes McKinnon to the 46. And good start to the game thus far for Deliverance. Yeah, we, we said it, Scott. He's going to have to start strong. None of that slow start in here against Problem. It's too good. Second and seven. And this is the formation Problem was working on. He was practicing against this read option right here. And he was blowing it up just like that in the Bam. back. That is not fluke right there, Coltrane. That's exactly what problem went to the back room and started working on with Sirius Mo. He's ready for that read option. The problem is Deliverance also has a 0-1 trap that he'll mix in, which is, will give you fits to start. As soon as you're in read option defense, it opens up the 0-1 trap. As soon as you go to your 0-1 trap defense, it opens up that read option. So you got to play a little cat and mouse here against Deliverance's offense. Third and 10, offset in the gun. Needs to get to the 39 and a half. This is scary, third and 10 against the goal. You know he's gonna be lurking out there. This is where problem flourishes. Can't get it away. And a fourth and 17 on your opening drive. What do you do, RG, after the big sack? Oh, uh, you're punting against problem. A against problem, I, I mean, fourth and 17, you almost always want to punt. But definitely against problem. He's going to send the heat. His user lurk is just way too good. And you got to get this out of bounds. All the way. And it's going to be inbounds. Landry could have came up and made a play on that, but he'll harmlessly go out of bounds at the 26-yard line. So they'll set their audibles, and problem. We'll have a chance to go to work. Got over the big hump against Skimbo, but he wants that belt. Yeah. That luminosity hat by problem. That's a nice hat. And Got the some J's on. You saw those Los Angeles Chargers too. Them and Keenan Allen. Look at those Steelers shoes though. Oh, Deliverance is his clothes game is on point. <laughs> He's got the Steelers pants, the shoes, the custom Deliverance jersey, the hat. He's a diehard Steelers fan. He says he bleeds that black and gold. Good work by the camera crew right there, giving you a peek at him. Problem. Getting tons of support from the Chargers, though. Keenan Allen reaching out to him. The Chargers orga organization. And they were happy when they realized they had the GOAT representing them, as they should be. But Deliverance isn't going to lay down for his Pittsburgh Steelers. He said it was a dream come true to represent his favorite team. And that's just some of the opportunities competitive Madden will give you. So first and 10 at the 26. Problem. Get it outside to Fournette. That'll pick up three. Nice blue controller right there. Set, three, three, three. 
You're allowed to bring your own controller here at these competitions, Scott. You know, he's seen Spot Me for years use the baby controller. I bought one of those. Yeah, you, you, that's what you one. said. It's a nice controller. See on the other side. Look at that. You gotta be wired right in, there? man. You gotta be wired in. You don't wanna mess around with that. Third and one. I like that shot we had on the camera showing the players make their adjustments, how fast their hand moves during pre-play. They're making offensive adjustments, hot routes, audibles on defense. You're shifting your line. Uh -oh. Fortnette, he was dead to right, and he battled for the first down. Deliverance had him right there for a three-yard loss. It was a huge truck by problem. He's, he's got that truck mastered right now. It's a big part of the meta. We saw guys like Matzner Gamer, Rocket. Drag was having success with it with Henry. Problem got his hands on that timing, and it's been a problem ever since. W was telling us this morning that he'll, he'll put Michael Vick into a truck. I, I got I to gotta wait to see that. Uh-oh! And Ooh. Fortnette will fall forward to the 48. Now that looked like a great run, Scott, but I'll tell you what, when you got a hole that big and that much space in front of you and you can only turn it into the 10-yard gain instead of break that out for, for a crib shot, it could be a little frustrating see them making their adjustments. You see that each flick right there, the stick, that Deliverance is doing is some sort of defensive adjustment, whether he's switching up the play call, hot routing a defender to a different assignment, shifting the line. It has a man, Whoa. and it's Bo Jackson down into the red zone at the 13-yard line. That's the left tackle, Bo Jackson. That problem subs in at the tight end position, gets him on a deep post route. You set up your defense to try to stop the outside run with Fournette, and next thing you know, right down the middle of the field for the strike. And how admirable is Problem's offense? We see everybody running some trips tight end, some gun punch. Problem coming out in some single back and just pounding Gets the rock. Gets a block. Boy, he should have went hit. to the right. Oh, rare, rare poor stick work right there from Problem. Had the block. Had the seam for Look the touchdown this. to the right. Look at this. What cuts it inside and uncharacteristic right there by the GOAT problem right, but he's still moving the ball. This is a big third and one for Deliverance. How big would this be? He's he had a touchdown. He has to run. He's going to run commit here, I have to believe. It means he's going to have his whole defense sell out to stop the run by holding the left trigger and flicking down on that right stick. He's going to use his final timeout wow. here in the first. And I'll, I'll tell you what that is, is Problem likes to use that audibles on the fly feature, so he's making so many audible adjustments at the play call screen. He runs out of time, so he ends up having to burn some timeouts in the first half so he can get his offense set. And that was set. part of Deliverance didn't agree to that gentleman's thing at the beginning. And I don't blame him. Do not blame him at all, Scott. When you're going up against the greatest Madden player of all time and your tournament life is on the line, you can't give him an inch. And so, not a, so Problem started using with the game by using a timeout to save those five yards. Yeah, and when I and say... And now he's got none. I should mention, though, Scott, when I say his tournament life on the line, I don't just mean... Everything. The club the season, championship. His season. Uh, we didn't touch on it much, but Deliverance, if he can win this game in an upset against the GOAT, he advances to Ultimate League. If not, Blocky's going to make it. You saw that graphic we showed you earlier. It was last Wednesday Damn. as Problem punches it in. We have no one heard of Deliverance. No. I mean, he made some run at a Challenger event, but... Yeah, he got to fifth place down in Miami. Nothing serious. And here he comes on the scene. He's in the AFC Championship representing the Steelers, but it's Problem in the Chargers that strike first, seven to nothing. And if you're blocky... Rico was saying, who would you rather be? I think right now, if you're blocky, you're feeling pretty good. That's Miami's club champion. Sit at home. He needs problem to win, and he's in. You talked about it. You said, how sweet would it be to have a camera in his living room watching this action? Yeah, we said that off camera. I would pay pay-per-view money for the footage of blocky walking as, around as his house right now. As long as he's not right wearing now, those short shorts that serious. he's wearing in Miami. Sure, we'll put them on. Yeah, the short shorts on in short Miami. Short shorts. 
Old school Larry Bird status. This was down in Miami at the club championship for the Dolphins. He came in like he just came right off the beach, and he, he might have. And that's what's cool about this club championship yeah. tournament is when you make it to the Final Four to represent your club to see who's going to represent them, a lot of these clubs will have an event at their venue where you get to go, you get that's to go awesome. on the field, that's you amazing. get to meet players, you meet the personnel. The team gets to know you a little bit, and it's a once-in-a-lifetime experience. A lot of these teams roll out the red carpet for their players. The problem doesn't look worried, does he? Got a 7-0 lead. And why not? You talked about him labbing back there really quick with Mo, And he's pretty much shut down anything in the running game off that offset. And that's just experience, though, Scott. This is I can't even keep track of how many... Final fours or final <laughs> games problems been into it. You can't. It's impossible. And that's just what he does. He's not sitting around. He's not happy to be here. He treats it like a business trip and he handles it the right way. So okay. it's third and five. We're over there getting brisket. He's hitting the lab. We can probably say that every day of our lives. True. Third and five at the 30. Big play for deliverance. Offset again. This is a big play for deliverance. You don't want to get stuck in the fourth down. Uh-oh, problem's lurking. Big play! And has Moss on a playmaker. We saw him use that to perfection throughout this tournament. And look at this replay. He's playing with fire. You see Problem tries to get over there, but Deliverance able to get it over Barr's head, which is not easy to do. Comes up big on third down. Anthony Barr, 6-5. And there's Winslow, senior, the legend. By the way, an incredible charger, Winslow, back in the day. Yeah. But he's not playing on the Chargers right now. This is him. ultimate team. He's on the Steelers. Love that about this ultimate team mode, Scott. Complete control. Coach, GM, owner, offensive coordinator, defensive coordinator. you got to do it all. Well, you saw Herschel Walker for Goes, a great cowboy running back. It doesn't matter. He's helping the Skins get to the finals. And for those that are savvy of Ultimate Team, we should mention, once you make it here to this event, let's let this play go. Once you make it here to this event, you get the entire Ultimate Team yeah. behind. We give you the keys to yeah. the Ferrari. You That's can right. use whatever players you want to put into your lineup as long as they're under the salary cap. And for a lot of us, that's a dream come true. I mean, like I said, it's like opening up the toy store and saying, hey, take whatever you want. Third and five. Throws oh, it to Reed. Big play. Oh, my goodness. And you see the leverage. Look at Lori. She's failing, and her man just came up big against the GOAT. Can't wipe that smile off her face. That was huge. 7-7. Seven to seven. seven plays, 70 yards, and a minute 47. He's focused. He's focused, Scott. You believe now. So the All drive. he needs that one this, thing, and now you believe. And he's a defensive player. This is going to be a big drive right here. He's got to stop problems run. Look at this, Cole. This is crispy. On the cover, two. Pass Woo. lead and outside problem. Just there in deliverance. is like, I'll take it. He grabs his heart. And that's intense. And this misses deliverance. Did he, say that? It. Did he just say that's oh. me all day, though? Did he just say that? He goes, that's me all day, though. Hey, he's been in the lab. He, he feels like he makes that play. The problems replay right there for Net. Well, how about Kraus getting off that block? Maybe save the touchdown. That was Ed Reed who came over to try to make the pick. Problems got three number 20s in his secondary. That can happen in ultimate <laughs> team, too. First and 10. Stretches it out to Fournette. Oh! And he's going to get loose. Cuts it back at the 15 and brought down right inside the red zone. They're going to mark it at the 13. And the former LSU Tiger gets loose. The deliverance, you got to do something on defense. You got to switch something up. These holes that problem is getting to run through are just too big. And if you give the GOAT that, he's going to take it all day and he's going to make you pay. Look at the focus right there, Eric Wright. A.K.A. Problem, A.K.A. The Goat, Deliverance, Cinderella Story. Hands it off to Sharp. He's going to have to run another play before the two-minute warning. 
Second and 10 from the 13. And in this MCS era, Scott, Skimbo's made four championship games. Only one other player's been made more than one championship game. And that's Eric Wright, who's made three. If he would be able to win this game and make the championship, he'd be tied with Skimbo for most championship games in the MCS era at four. Which is insane seeing how he dominated pre-MCS era back in the Madden Challenge. That longevity Could is... be his fifth championship overall if he's able to win these next two. Wow. That's quite the resume. Wow. Two minutes to go, third and nine. There you go, Deliverance. Here's the time to get some momentum if you can get a stop here. Hold the, hold the goat to three. Mariota, the that's green. the flats. And forces him out of bounds at the five. That's a nice play combination. I think Problem was looking for a block from his tight end. Didn't get it. He's probably going to have to settle for three here. And I'll take that three up from Problem. Need you to can, get points. You can see him just going through the play call screen. He's he's okay. He's going back and forth here, well, and he's, he's going to go. I, I don't think he's going for this. I, I go think up there and try to snap he's going to fake snap it and, and take the delay of game if he has to. He's going to try to catch deliverance offsides. He's not going to hike this ball. Half the distance to the goal would be a first down. And he's going to back him up five. He's going to try to take a three-point lead. It'll be a 27-yarder and coming for problem. It's one of those situations if you're deliverance, you're on that aggressive pass rush. You better know to go to conservative on that fourth down. Don't want to jump off sides. Kick is up, and it is good. The Chargers. Taking a three-point lead. I just find myself in shock sometimes, Cole, that I'm still up here calling Eric Problem right games this deep in the tournaments. I mean, it, the longevity is just something special. It's legendary. And, and people... Uh, oh, that's a nice return. People give me a hard time. I, I, I get harassed about a cold train. Hey, stop riding problem. You give them too much. No, I've been around. I've seen it all. Like, no one's bluffing me. I know what this man has done, and it's nothing short of remarkable. I'm sorry. I, I've seen it happen too many times not to give him his credit. He's okay. <laughs> First and 10 at the 35. Tell him not to his face. <laughs> Hey, after his last post-game interview, I'm not making eye contact ever again. Yeah, yeah, better be careful. <laughs> Put me on a T-shirt. And he is the type of guy, he uses the negative talk of motivation. Sure. If people are saying, Skimbo's the new go, problems washed up, when's the last time he wants something? He doesn't take that stuff lightly. He uses it as real motivation. And he's the type of dude to come out there and prove you wrong. See what Deliverance has here. Fake snap, and that's going to get Mean Joe Green into the neutral zone. And some encroachment. That'll make it second and six. He's got all three timeouts, a minute 26, and you have the opportunity to go down here and take the lead. Yeah. These are your moments. Exactly. This is your moment where your deliverance. We call this baptism on the fire. And although we've seen some players, especially some younger ones, you know, 16, 17, 18 years old, playing problem for the first time, things didn't go their way. Deliverance is not that kind of guy. He's not going to be shook. No, no, he's here to rock. And this is an experience that you don't just get this kind of experience playing online. Win or lose, he's going to come out of this game a better Madden player. First down at the 49, 60 seconds to go. Still has his full timeouts. Kennan. Time can't get away. And he's going to use his first time out, second and 10. 53 seconds to go in the half. Got to get three. Problem right here. He's going to his trips tight end. You got to watch the corner route from the tight end. The read option of the 0 1 trap. It's been deliverance of bread and butter out of this formation. Dan Bailey is his kicker. So really needs to get down to be comfortable at the 33 yard line. the corner from the tight end. Gets loose with Russ. And Wilson gets out of bounds at the 46. That'll stop the clock. I like Deliverance right now, though. You see how focused he looks. He's not getting too excited. Get boy. Get boy. 
So man, that calm, means business. Calm between his play calls. Yep. But this is keep, a big third down. You need to keep your points if you're delivering. Needs five. Keep the drive alive. Cross Wilson. side the nickel back. That's good defense. Coming off the edge is the sack man, Richard Dent. Does the Super Bowl shuffle on third down. The deliverance, you have to be careful here. I'm almost considering putting this ball because problem has no timeouts. It's Laurie looking on. Rocking her Steelers gear. No dent set in the Super Bowl shovel. The quarterback's gonna get bent. <laughs> the sack man dead. <laughs> sack the man quarterback's dead. gonna get yeah. bent. And here's fourth and nine. Look at this defense. Kids right. have no idea what I'm talking about right now. 1985 is outside their realm. It's before I was born. No stop. It's not bears, man. That's your, your bears. It was like number one on the charts. They filmed it, they, they recorded it in week 12, RG. The Super Bowl shuffle. Play right here by deliverance. I have it on vinyl. That, that, that tells you how old it is. Fourth and four, big play here. Has two timeouts. Needs to get to the 41. Problem's been sending a lot of three-man rush with a spy. There it is again. Oh, that's big. He tried to playmaker Moss and couldn't get rid of it. He had him open. Okay, if you're delivered, you got to protect the sidelines right here. You cannot let Problem complete this corner route to the B receiver. Watch the post down the middle as well. And he oh, gets caught up. I'm asleep. And that's how the half will end if, if you're told deliverance, hey, you're going to be down three at the half, the problem, you pro you're probably like, okay, okay, I'm in it. You don't want to just begin it right now, though. With ultimate league on the line, Scott, you're a diehard Steelers fan. Oh, wow. You really have a chance to do something special here in this game. And you don't get many chances in life like this where you can do something really special that will be with you forever. This is one of those moments for deliverance. Start of the second half, Problem will have the rock. Stretches it out. Has some room! Oh! Yeah, stop! Oh, no. This is on him! But the goal is on his Forget about it! Oh my goodness, Coltrane! And if you didn't hear me, I said that was on animal behavior. But the goat was on his horse. He went full Allen Iverson. What a move. He did the Hezzy, the stop, the crossover like Ivy. And Deliverance was on skates. Oh, the stick work is phenomenal. That was nasty, Scott. That was disgusting. The lead is now 10. And if you don't know my vocabulary, when I say disgusting, I mean that was really, really good. Wow. Two possession ball game deliverance in a situation here where he needs to respond. Oh. Let's open up Google Translate, put it on RG. Look at this. Brew, has he? Now right here. Whoopsie, that is nasty. Get on skates, get out of my way. And let the goat get on his horse. Clear the way, let the man come through. First and 10. Oh no, look at poor Lori. Well, she's gasping. You know, B's at home going nuts right now, her and baby EJ. Yeah, oh, absolutely. Rooting on. You gotta have it here, Deliverance. You gotta have at least a field goal. Touchdown would be sweet. That run was something special, Scott. And there's another aggressive move by Mean Joe Green trying to get in there on the snap. That's those coaches adjustments. You set it to aggressive and come back to bite you. Yep. If it's on aggressive, you get a better pass rush. Guys react off the off the ball better on the passing plays, but you fake snap, they got a good chance to jump off sides. So second and nine. Deliverance, it's time to fight. Problem trying to move on to the final to face goes. 
and the Redskins. Will it be Chargers and Skins or will it be Steelers and Redskins? Talk about two historic franchises. Absolutely. And of course when the Chargers came over from the AFL, they were one of the most high-powered offenses. And who can forget, we talked about before, Dan Fouts to Winslow. A little bit before my time. But I've seen some was, NFL films. That was pre-85. Seen some NFL films. You know, I wasn't at World War II, but Ooh. I, I kind of got the gist of what happened. You don't have to be alive to experience. You have to get knowledge. Crack a book, RG. Come on. What do you mean? I, I like to read. Books. That's Seinfeld, <laughs> where, where Jerry goes, I like to read. And Elaine goes, books, Jerry, books. <laughs> He's like, oh, sorry about that. First and 10 at the 28. Oh, we're talk I was talking defenses. <laughs> <laughs> this is big right now for delivering, Scott. And already in field goal range. Gotta, you got to make it a one-possession game right exactly. here. Exactly. Even if you take three, it's okay. Making sure you don't turn the ball over right now and you turn this into points. That, that's the number one priority for deliverance. Second and ten. Joseph McKinnon. Going to eke out a yard. It's going to be third and nine. Can't take a sack. And 16 rushes for 42 yards. That's a result. Problem going backstage with serious mode, knowing exactly what deliverance wants to do. And McKinnon's a home run hitter. You know, he's not... He's going to try to run by you. He's not going to run over you. Look at the stick work. Oh, my gosh. Look at and that it's on the ground. Work. And it was picked up by problem, but did not have possession in bounds. That yep. would have done it. A high-level Madden player will understand what problem just did with his Anthony Barr right there. Took away about two routes. Big field goal. Took away two routes. Ran down, manually took away the scramble, but not only took away the scramble, triggered a strip animation, the force of fumble. The guy's just out of this world. So it's a seven-point game. Problem will get a chance to go back to work. Let's take a look at this again, RG. Yeah. See him, he's guarding the corner route, went down for the drag, and then gets on Mariota, triggers wow. the huge strip fumble, mm. almost gets the turnover he needed to really put deliverance tournament life on on the line i think if chris harris doesn't scoop that that bosa picks it up in bounce yeah it was that close it's a game of inches and that that fumble getting ruled out of bounds those inches just kept deliverance alive he needs a big defensive play and we've seen him make several of them in this tournament he is still very much in this ball game cinderella trying to make the ball second and six down the middle Close. Needed a pass lead, just a bit short. Well, and here's the thing. That's the tackle Bo Jackson, so he doesn't have the best catch rating. Good swat. But he, it's going to be hard for Bo to make those catches in traffic like that. Don't be surprised if you see him drop that every now and then. Great point, RG. Ooh. And Landry takes a hit at the 49, and for Delerich, you're playing against the GOAT, but you're also starting to play against the clock. Yeah, he, he took the words right out of my mouth. What's going to happen right now, Scott? His problem is going to take his time. Oh, there's a little quick hike. Oh, gosh. Fournette. I'm surprised problem hiked the ball so soon. What I anticipate here, maybe he's going to wait till he gets into field goal range. His problem is going to take his time right now. Yeah, see him chew, chew, chew the clock? He's going to try to just get into field goal range, kill as much time as he can, make sure he gets three and then make it two possessions. 15 carries, 169 yards, and two touchdowns for Leonard Fournette. If you're deliverance, you need to come up big right here on this third and one. These next two downs are huge if you could blow up the run. There Didn't it is. Get a block, oh but he got God. a truck. And that's got to be rough for deliverance. He's constantly getting back there to make the user tackle, but problem just timing this truck perfectly. That's user on user. Throwing Fortnite the Fortnite throwing off Miles Jack. Oh, Jack. Good call. 
Thank you for that correction, Scott. Two pretty good youngsters in the league. And by the way, they're both on Jacksonville. Here's the thing, problem keeps doing these trucks. All it takes is one time to really good big hit. And he can let that ball go. And that would be the turnover deliverance desperately needs right now. And remember, problem has a good kicker in that Adam Vinatieri on the verge of field goal range. Who's going to face goes tonight on ESPN2? But you see the play clock, Scott? He's constantly just killing time right now. He's taking as much time as he possibly can. He's not snapping it until there's about five seconds underneath the play clock. Lori looking on, waiting for Deliverance to make one of those big defensive plays he's made. Problem not giving him many opportunities, though. If you looked up concern in the dictionary, it'd be that face. <laughs> well said, Scott. He's coming out to a little move. Check the win. He's got six miles an hour at his Smart. back. Wow. And he'll take a timeout. What he did right there was come out on third down because he got a kick arc. So you can see how far you are from being able to make the field goal. So problem wanted to come out, gauge how far of the field goal is, how many more yards he needs to determine if he needs to pass a run here. I think he's going to run the ball. Third and five, stretches it out again with Fournette. It's going to be a 50-yarder from there for problem. And remember, he's got Adam Vinatieri with the focus kicker trait. That's where you're going to see this bar move really slow. Let's see if he kicks it perfect, though. Perfect. It's right mm, on the edge. I, that might not. He can, could get this kick blocked, maybe. It looks like it's outside you can't of it to tell. me. You can't tell. You'll know if the, the blue flicker comes up under the kicker if it truly was perfect. Fourth and four. This is scary. Clock winding down. It's and it was. it was. It was a perfect kick. And it can't be blocked. And that's why he goes with Vinatieri. Uh, he, I talked to him about that, too. I said, Prop, you spend a lot of cap on your kicker compared to these other guys. Aren't you good with the timing? He says, gee, I've been on that big stage <laughs> more than enough times to know that those kicks are something different than when you're at home in your living room. That's true. And I'm not trying to mess one of those up. And that's just experience right there. I mean, he's, he spent, put it in perspective, Deliverance has Dan Bailey, who he spent 15 cap on for that 900 salary cap. Problem as to Adam Vinatieri, who we spent 27 cap on. There's a big difference right there. It's just, like the I legs said, are the same, but it's all about the chemistry. Experience for problem. Ten point lead. The Steelers and Deliverance have got to make a comeback. 17 rushes, 47 yards, not enough. Laurie's got to get her terrible towel out, start spinning that thing, get, get some momentum in here for Deliverance. And deliverance, we talked about it off the top, has to win this Good game to read. get into the ultimate lead, and it's a read to read. Nice little corner strike right there. Problems locked into the league. Deliverance needs the dub. Problem was in a hard, flat type defense right there, which opened up that deep corner route. That was a really good read by Deliverance. This run's just not working for him, though. So 18 rushes, 46 yards. He's not going to cut it against the greatest Madden player of all time. Needs to get in the field goal range. Check it down. Good read, Deliverance. And there is Winslow. Gains eight. Seven and a half. Let's call it third and three. And that time, problem at his corners in cloud flats instead of hard flats, which means they'll drop back further to play that corner route that Deliverance completed the last time. Gave away the short stuff underneath. Deliverance makes the right read. Here comes that read option. Hands it to oh. McKinnon. Finish it here. Oh, problem says finish it here. It would be him. a 52 yarder from there, but he's going. Oh, no. He's against the win right now, remember. It's going to be ball game for Deliverance if he doesn't get it. Empties out the backfield. Why are you going empty right now? Is he going sneak? Got to watch out for the sneak of your problem. There he goes, gets the running back back there. You can't call a timeout either if you're Deliverance. Wilson has wide, goes there. Good read. That was oh, a big. touch pass, though. 
but he picks up the first down. Oh, that was scary. I put some power in that. Oh, that was scary, Coltrane. First and ten. Deliverance will not go you, within the night. Not going to go without a fight. I ask this question every time. Do you kick the field goal and, and try to fight? Uh oh Because this is, this is a lot of wasted time here. It gets, I, it gets stingy down here, man. He, here's the thing, Cole. You still got three timeouts. And Can't get, use one. And getting deep into problems territory is not easy. No. So I think you do until you get the fourth down. You got to continue to work for the touchdown right here instead of immediately. Of course, kicking if you get the goal. touchdown, that would open up the onside kick. And there's Richardson. The clock it. will move. No, he dropped, dropped it. it. Mm. Did I just Larry up there? Shout out to Larry, our guy. Third and ten at did the a lot 31. Of work in the, those club events. And they're gonna be rock and rolling up in New York soon too. Trip to the right. Here on third and ten. Problem's gonna send this three-man rush against Scott with a spy. It's been giving the deliverance trouble all game long. Yeah, he doesn't know where to go. Rolls. He doesn't know where to go. That spy's got it messed up. Throw it away and kick the field goal, oh, young man. Throw it away and kick the, the field goal. Oh my goodness. Look at this defense by problem. Three man rush. It was a 48 yard field goal. Yeah, he's got a. You're right, Scott. He needed to throw that away and kick the field goal. No need to force that pass right there. These guys talking to each other about. He felt like he had to go for the touchdown there because he wasn't. Going to get a stop. Either way, you kick the field goal. Yeah. Live to fight another down. You extend the game. Find it, I find it funny when they start talking to each other up there, even though they got the noise canceling headphones and the white noise in the background. Man, he's reading lips. He was yelling at each other. I mean, we could hear deliverance from here. <laughs> oh, man. Had some opportunities. Now, I've seen crazier things. The problem sure. is those crazy things didn't happen against the greatest Madden player of all time. Stretches it out. So now we got fourth and eight, 56 seconds to go. It's not over. We never said it was over. Deliverance. But you're going to need some magic here in Minnesota. He does this sometimes, Scott. He comes out in this quarter three deep instead of punt return. And I haven't seen it pay off for him yet. I, I, I'm very confused. Maybe he'll show us something here. Doesn't matter. So ball at the 28. Still has one timeout. 51 seconds to go. I'm just, I'm just in shock, Scott. The consistency of this man and Eric problem right is just greatness. Goes in the Redskins, is waiting for the winner tonight. 9 p.m. Eastern, ESPN 2. A big hit. He gets who it is, number 55. Funny thing is, championship game going down, like you said, ESPN 2, 9 o'clock. You know that gives go some problem a couple hours each to prepare for each other. And they're not going to take that time lightly. Not on the move after the short gain to Moss. Hate to count deliverance out here, I mean, but looking very grim. He'll pick up the first down with Wilson. And that's when he'll use his final timeout. Got to get down there, kick a quick field goal, and try to get the onside kick. No problems, you know, he's going to get away with this one. He's going to tie Michael Skimbo for the most championship games in the MCS era. Hopefully the fourth time's the charm for Eric Problem Right. Now what does that do to his status, his GOAT status, if he's able to win one of these belts in the MCS era? Coltrane. It might cement it. I hate to say that, kind of like when Jordan came back and got the next three rings. I mean, that makes it that makes it a, that makes it tough, Jack. 
Nicholas, 18 majors. You know, it, you know, you can it's you special. can be Tiger Woods all you want, but until you get there. And uh, people might not appreciate it now, but as competitive Madden grows, and this sport continues to get bigger and bigger, I think we'll realize that I don't think we're ever going to see a player quite like Eric Problem right again. There's just there's just too many accolades, too much consistency. I, I don't know if anyone's going to ever be able to replicate this. He's under pressure on that throw, and that's going to bring up fourth in the game. I mean, if you're a luminosity game, and you made the right decision <laughs> in going out and so getting yourself hey, involved Chargers with competitive Hey, Chargers are feeling pretty good about it, too. Oh, They're I, in Los I bet Angeles. you Keenan Allen's going to be tweeting out problem after this one. And he's a big Madden guy. Huge Madden guy. As is Melvin Ingram, who's yeah. on the team. Bosa. And that's it. And that'll do it. GG's in the chat. GG's in the chat. 20 to 10. Oh, you see that right there by delivering, showing the respects to the GOAT. And that's because he knows what that man's all about. He knows what he's accomplished. And like I said, deliverance, even though he lost that game, he's going to come out of that game a better Madden player. You don't get that type of experience and not learn from it. And he was great. He was fantastic. He made an awesome run. I really enjoyed seeing him play. Him and his girlfriend, Lori, were awesome. But it's that man, Eric, writes time, and he's hungry. And when he's hungry, he, there's not much that can stop him from getting that championship. I'll tell you one thing. Deliverance will go back and watch this and realize he had some opportunities yeah. to make it a game. It just slipped right through his fingers. And that's the setting. It's going to be goes and problem in our final tonight. And problem is standing by with Adrian Lawrence. Problem, congratulations. You are the AFC champ. You are going to the Super Bowl. How pumped are you? I'm hyped. You know, uh, to be back in the finals, it means a lot. I got to finish the job. There's been four salary cap tournaments throughout the MCS, and I've been in the finals of every one of them. Unfortunately, I haven't came out with that belt yet, but I'm looking to make a change today. Yes, and Donnie told me this will be your fourth finals appearance, and so you're actually going to tie Skimbo for it. And I know that this means a lot to you to be able to take home that belt. Mm. What's your motivation? Um, my wife and my, my newborn are my motivation, uh, but as far as Madden goes, you know, just wanted to be the best, and uh, hopefully I can get it done. And you just took on Deliverance, who's kind of an up-and-comer in the industry. What would you tell the Madden community about his game? I mean, I think they know already. They've seen him knock off some great players, so he's definitely uh, somebody that they should respect, and, you know, hope to see him around soon. And you're going on to face Ghost in the final. What do you expect? I expect a good game. Goes is, you know, he's a great offensive player. I, I feel like I can uh, slow him down a little bit, and, you know, hopefully I can do that. Uh, one last thing, um, Blocky got in, and uh, shout-outs to him, the newest member of TopMadden.com. Blocky into the Ultimate League, so that, that's awesome. All right, and I see Ghost is right behind us. You want to come past him? Come on over here. And so you get your wish. You are going to face Problem, yeah. the GOAT. Man, how are you feeling right now? I feel great, man. It's a great opportunity. I just, I can't wait to play. All right, and who are you going to take to the Super Bowl? Oh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's a great question. Uh, w, no, definitely not W. <laughs> definitely not W. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> that's one person that's not going is W. Yeah, there it is. All right, duly noted. Well, congratulations to you both, and we're super excited to see you in the finals. All right, back to you guys. Thank you.